Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Which president created the Department of Treasury? In the newborn United States, managing finances was a monumental task. The need for a strong financial institution was clear. A department was envisioned to handle government revenue. This department would also produce the nation's currency, and it would formulate economic policy. But which president brought this vision to life? Let's delve into the past. The year was 1789, a time of powdered wigs and quill pens. The U.S. Constitution had just been ratified. The young nation was setting up its government structure. Among the top priorities was handling debts from the Revolutionary War. A financial wizard was needed at the helm. Enter a founding father known for his financial acumen. This individual was a key figure in the nation's founding. He was appointed as the first Secretary of the Treasury. Under his guidance, the Department of Treasury was established. It became a cornerstone of the federal government. So who was in the presidential seat at this time? None other than the first President of the United States. His leadership and support were vital. The Department of Treasury was born, setting financial precedents for the future. Now, the moment you've been waiting for. The president who created the Department of Treasury was George Washington. His appointment of Alexander Hamilton as the first Secretary of Treasury was a defining moment. The Department of Treasury has come a long way since 1789. Today, it's a key player in the U.S. economy. It oversees the IRS, prints money, and manages federal finances. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.